Halloween displays like these are perfectly spooky with the help of dry ice. Right now we're in the production facility. Co-president Peter Mueller gave us a tour of Cryocarb. He and his brother Ed operate the Beloit-based company. Cryocarb is a division of welder supply company and we're an independently owned uh, welding supply company. That also specializes in dry ice. The liquid CO2 comes through our piping. So this would be the CO2 that's been converted into the dry ice now. Instantly. Wow. Turned into dry ice through a plate and comes out looking like pasta. And the dry ice that's forming is very cold. Negative 109 degrees Fahrenheit. That's why I'm wearing these gloves. Machines form the blocks of ice and wrap them. We could produce 1,500 pounds of dry ice in an hour. A lot of people think of dry ice and they think about it as something that they can keep their food cold or for a Halloween display, but it has more purposes than that. Absolutely. Uh, dry ice is used for blasting, like similar to sandblasting. It's a much cleaner process. You take the, the pellets, the three millimeter pellets, you stick it in into a dry ice uh, blasting machine. Dry ice hits the piece. It shocks the piece, non-abrasive. It started in 1938, and we love to buy local, and we like to sell local. Wisconsin's a great place to do business in, and the people are great. In Beloit, Sheldon Dutez, WISN, 12 News. Didn't know about that blasting role. Cryocarb employs 55 workers across Beloit, Burlington, Big Bend, and at two locations in Illinois.